in ruins. Merely resembles a ghost town. A rare glimpse into Pakistan's current offensive against militants in North Waziristan, regarded as the last sanctuary of the hardened Taliban fighters. The captured weapons show how the Taliban was well prepared. The bombs have inflicted heavy military casualties. We have been able to uh, defuse 4,000 IEDs so far. Uh, they have planted it in the houses, they have planted it in the streets, they have planted it even in the trees. Uh, so that is the scale and magnitude of uh, the entire operation, which of course uh, um, pose considerable challenges to the uh, armed forces or the ground forces that uh, get applied here. The current operation began in June and the aim was to stop the militants from attacking Pakistan and Afghanistan. Taliban militancy is described as an existential threat to the country. Some are skeptical about the military's claims. They believe many top leaders fled to neighboring Afghanistan before the offensive started. But the military is claiming success. Nearly a million people were ordered to leave before the operation began. Many live in refugee camps and others with their relatives. When they return, Many will have to rebuild their lives from scratch.